Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Bloodborne's DLC. And before we... Actually, before, actually, there is no before. We're going. And yeah, I still am being real lazy. As a result, I know where I'm going because I'm not going to try and go through that upper cathedral thing with like 11 blood vials. So we're going to be going to the Advent Plaza and going through the college. Because from what little I remember about the college, I don't think I will need a whole ton of blood vials. I might need maybe 10. I think I have 11, so I should be fine. I think the worst thing in there is like people lobbing spells at you from a from like a distance away, and hopefully I can get through that. So yeah, that's that's what we're going to be doing. Because if I went through the other place, I already know I would be screwed because I remember dying in there quite a lot, and that was with infinite, basically infinite blood vials. Because I haven't been co-oping nearly as much off camera as I did the first time through the game, so that is my reasoning, that's what I'm sticking with. And if someone voted for it, go to, uh, whatever, go to the Upper Cathedral Ward, then I'll do that tomorrow night, and I'll just have it, this one uploaded, the, like, out of order, but I will do so. So, I don't remember a darn thing about here except I about the whole, you know, people lobbing spells at you, the scholars over there. I think this is probably locked. I remember Stitches is here. I guess he's, yes, this is not locked. I remember Stitches is here. And I think I remember stuff falling down from the ceiling somewhere, but I don't remember much else. This entire, oh, I was going to say, this entire room just makes me paranoid. And a good reason right there. Okay, I just want to make sure. Make sure. The sedative. That's an item we have not really got into yet. I guess I can't shoot that. The sedative is if you... It lowers your frenzy buildup. And if you all know what frenzy is, you will soon enough. Oh, yes, you will. Oh, I said go backwards. Frenzy is basically... After the character's seen some shit, and they panic, and they die. I say they die of a heart attack, because it, I don't know any other reason why you just go, Oh my god, and just die. Okay, you have a myocardial infarction is my best guess here, okay? Not saying it's right, I'm just saying that's my guess. It could be right, I don't know. But it doesn't seem like something else really could be it. And yes, these things are creepy as fuck, if you ask me. Just their eyes, just the way they look. They're like, oh my. I mean, they don't have... I get... They just have black eyes. I don't know if they even have eyeballs. They just... Oh. It's like... I don't even know. It's like so... Not threatening that it's scary. In a weird way. Oh, I need to go left. And that's what I'm talking about. Those two guys just... Tossing crap at you, I think. So I'm just gonna run. Because I don't remember crap else here. Probably should be using this. Oh, jeez. That'll stun you. For the record, I'm pretty sure I should have gotten hit about three times there. Somehow, I managed to not do it. Oh, jeez. Not today. Not today. You almost got me, though. I have no clue why the first one was a glancing blow. I'm pretty sure I just crushed his skull, but I guess I'll go with it. I guess he doesn't really have a skull. He's more of a gelatinous man. That'd be a crappy superpower, for the record. Gelatinous. Like... I can turn it to jello. So what? What does that get you? I don't know. Right. Thank you for playing the game today, sir. I think this is just flavor text in here. Yep. I should be able to hear babies cry soon enough. <laughs> that probably sounds really disturbing when I just word it like that, but I'm pretty sure that's what it does. And once you get to a certain Insight, I just don't remember when it was. I recommend just rolling through doorways here, because at any point, I, as you saw, you could be dropped on by a, a scholar. Thankfully, they, they're they of the first sin variety. You know, they, they're the one trying to kill you first, so I mean, it kind of fits with the whole series, really. Oh, right, there it is. The Nameless Moon presence beckoned by Lawrence and his associates, Pale Blood. Why did we just add pale blood at the end of that? Okay, fine. 
Now this door, I think, is the door out. Isn't it? I think it is. But I haven't found stitches yet. There's stitches. That's the thing from Darkwood in World of Warcraft. What the hell is in here? Who, th who the hell's the bald guy? Is his name Stitches? I don't know. You think I would know that? Considering I've done this so many times. Oh, that thing. No. No, 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 no. I hate fighting those things. I can do it. I just don't like doing it. I guess it's no worse than fighting these disturbing ass things, but still. Ugh. Just. It's like a scarecrow face. It's just. Oh. I don't know why, it just gets to me. I don't know if that's Scarecrow the way I'm looking for or not, but that is just... No. I don't know what that thing is. Obviously it doesn't cause frenzy, so I don't even know what that thing is doing. Honestly. <laughs> kind of stings a little bit, I guess. Oh, j You dick. That's some Call of Duty bullshit right there. I say this, no oh, Jesus. Christ in heaven, why are you here, both of you? I guess there were two of them, weren't there? I was just too stupid to not remember it. Oh, no. Pretty sure I rolled right through that and should not have gotten away with that. Just gotta stick and move. Stick and move. Or something. I don't even know what that means. I'm not a boxer. I think that means you... I don't know what stick means in that lingo, but I know what move means, so I, I guess I got half of the strategy right. I don't really think boxing lingo is going to help me out here, really. Now I know that dude... What? Wait, no, his name is... Why did I think his name's Hyena? Because it was something to Hyena, wasn't it? I don't know. Hell, I, I, I don't think I'll ever remember. <laughs> oh, I went in here. All right. Sorry. I'm not going in there because I remember that's the end of the level if you do that. What I would like to do is kill that thing. But I see it it, it knows pyromancy and it scares me. So what can I do here? I think there was a door, wasn't there? Aha. One of these doors is bad. I remember that. I think this is the door actually as well. Uh yep. Yep, yep, yep. One of these things scared the crap out of me before. I don't remember where. But at least I know to look up now. Because I've read somewhere that's one of the hardest things to get people to do is look upward. So I'm, I'm trying to... Trying to break that habit of not looking up. Whether it'll help or not is another thing entirely, but I think it has so far, so I think it's paid for itself. Ooh, communion, that sucks. <laughs> Especially for me right now, because I don't have the whole... You know, blood vials. But I'd take it as a challenge run. I don't need no blood vials. I can do this with only nine. Especially considering this place is so freaking easy. But, you know, it's neither here nor there. And probably sounds a bit douchebaggy when I say it like that. Yeah, because you said that, you're going to die now. Could be. Could be. I might, well, actually, come to think of it, I think there's a door back there I forgot. Patches. That's his name. Patches the Hyena, wasn't it? Why did I think his name was Stitches? Dude, that thing in Darkwood killed me so many times. That big puddle of fat. I don't even know if that place is still there. I haven't played since, like, Burning Crusade, but still. Patches. Why did I think his name was Stitches? I guess because they're both douchebags and they both try to kill you. I don't know. I think he was a level 26 elite? Why the hell do I remember that? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, man. That brings back memories. Patches, right. Well, Patches isn't even here until you get to the the college the second way, is it? Like when you go downstairs. Crap, dude. Why am I standing around here trying to fight a giant then? There's no point to kill that thing. Except to like get maybe like... I don't know. I'm not doing it. Because that thing was annoying, I remember. I do wish that you would just open the door and then you didn't have to go through it. That would have been nice, but I, I guess it was for the cinematic feeling of it. That's my best guess. Otherwise... <laughs> oh, yes. The Nightmare Plane. Well, I'm going to call it Nightmare Plane. The Nightmare of Mensis? I don't know what the hell it's called. Menses? I don't know how you pronounce that. 
I remember this place sucks total ass. I remember that part, but I don't remember much more about it. I remember the boss here kicked my butt a fair few times. Not much more, though. Not much more. Where the hell is the lantern? Did I miss the lantern? I think I missed the lantern last time, too. I think I just, like, walk right past it. Maybe there wasn't even there. I don't know. Uh, no, it does not appear to be one here, so I guess I just didn't miss it. Or maybe I just missed it twice in a row. Which is possible. It is possible. Not very likely, but it's possible. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. This is not where I thought I was. No, 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 no. Shouldn't I be at the place where, like... I don't know, like... Where the hell am I thinking of? With the... With the... The... The, the big... Thing that's been following you around since the cathedral district. Where the hell's that at? Amygdala. Where the hell's the amygdala boss at? I thought this was the place. Well, it's obviously not. Okay, fine. The problem with this place is I'm not one. I'm not ready for it. And two, uh, these things suck balls. Uh, in a bad way, uh, because they are very fast and they're very weird to fight, as I recall. And apparently, they don't take crap for damage. Which is always a bit of a problem. I'm trying all the different kinds of damages that I have. I'm trying to find out which one might actually work. Oh, Jesus. That's not good. They hit very hard. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Just go full on idiot. That'll help. To be fair, that actually almost did help. But I just keep him away. If I keep away. I don't know how to fight this thing. It's pretty obvious. Oh, gee, oh, now they're even worse. <laughs> no. That was an ordeal, just fighting the one of them. Forgot they, oh, those are worse than the thing itself. All oh, the worse. What, seriously though, what was I thinking of with the place of the amygdala boss? I'm not there. <laughs> I know that much just by looking at the place. I know where exactly where I'm at. I'm at the place with the, the, the dude with the, the cage on his head. <laughs> the guy that killed Conceive Sorrow in like one bullshit cast. And somehow I managed to not die. <laughs> or did I die? I don't know, I might have died. I think th they have the same thing as- Oh no 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 no! I think they have the same thing as ISF, don't you, don't you fall off that, you dick. Suicidal moron. <sighs> oh! Now, before you think I'm just Nick, I'm just, what's the opposite of nictophobic? I don't know. Before you think I'm like scared of light, there's a reason why I'm not just going and running up there. If you get caught in that light, your frenzy resists. Doesn't matter if you're looking at it or not. Your frenzy goes up, up, up. And when it reaches the top, I believe you die instantly. So you know, there's, there's that. I'm, I'm pretty sure there should have been a lantern already, though. Shouldn't there not have been a lantern? Did I miss the lantern with my just panicking? What? Because I'm... I, I I know there has to be a lantern. It's just cruel they don't put one. Wait, no, I know where one lantern is. I know where one is. But... I don't think it's back here. Well, shit. Okay, no, it's gonna be the journey to find the lantern. Alright, I know exactly where it is. It's just, it's just a hell getting there. Because the lantern is on a very narrow cliff, I remember. I don't remember much else. Thinking about it, I really should put a... What's the word? Sedative on my hotbar, just in case I do get caught out, so to speak. Where is it? I just, walk, I just zoomed right past it, I see. Where is it? I will find it eventually. Make Mark my words. There it is. Don't need anything else on my hotbar, just might as well have the sedative up there and ready. Oh, there's the lantern. I'm just being too much of a pussy now, wasn't I? Okay, fine. The other lantern is a very far distance from here. Ugh. Crap. It's only been 15 minutes. I hate to call it a day already. Fine, I'll go. Ow. I think I just saw blood splurt out of me for no real reason. Oh shit. Oh, 
Mama, how did I not get hit by that? There was no way that should have ever happened. No, come over here. Come over here. Oh crap, there's two ways going around that. Wish I'd have known that. Really would have helped me. Oh, this is not gonna end well. This tis not gonna end well. Okay, I tried something badass there and it just kind of failed. Really badly. I'll just stun log it to death. No, it's not gonna work. Oh! Maybe it might? It might? Damn you! Damn you and your... your dodging. Oh. No. I don't even bother trying to kill those things because it sucks trying to kill those things. I mean, you can. It's just... Ugh. It's terrible. Ow. And no, I don't know why you get hurt just by getting freaked out. It just happens. Deal with it, I guess, is what their their stance on the matter. Like, who thought this was a fun area to go through? I, I ask you that. Who thought, you know what, you know what would be fun? Some place where you just have to, like, not ever be out in the open. And fight where you don't ever want to fight. I seriously want to know who thought, you know what? That's a real great idea, Steve. Fucking Steve, with his ideas. I don't know who did it, but still, who came up with this? I mean, I get that it's, di it's difficult, I'm not arguing that, but it's just annoying difficult as opposed to, you know, challenging difficult. Maybe that's just one man's opinion. That's just my opinion. I'm bitching while somehow managing to get through this, and then a worm bites me twice, and I'm almost dead. Because of freaking Steve again with his rocks. All right, Steve wanting to get in his rocks off, and apparently, you know, it just kind of screwed me there. Take that however you want it, really. I'm gonna try and get to the other bonfire if nothing else. I hate this area. This is my least favorite area in the entirety of Bloodborne. I think I said that once before, but I'm pretty sure this one. Most people would agree with me here. Considering, you know, the restriction of movement and the pain in the balls this whole thing is. And the worst part is, I think that there's another thing over yonder here. I think I'm behind that. I should be behind that. Okay, then. I think I'm behind that. No, I'm not behind that. You dicks. Look, I just want to aggro the one thing. Can you, like, go down? I don't want to use a sedative here if I don't have to. Making sure the worms aren't going to sneak up on me, man. The worms will get you. I don't know if they really will follow you or not, but... Open up. I'm going to... I should op open up my own pet store. Name it. I got worms. That's what we're going to call it. I got worms. Oh, well. Oh, no, my bad. Sorry. It's not two of the same things. No, it's just two of those things. I don't even remember what those are. <laughs> Oh, crap. Hopefully those things are affected. Sorry, I think I just hit that there. Hopefully those things are affected here. Hey, guys, what's going on? Please tell me you're affected. They don't appear to be affected, Barak. Oh, fuck. No. This is one of the very few times I'll actually use a sedative here. Okay, they are affected. You just gotta use the environment against them. Which, to be fair, is a decent mechanic. I do like that I can use the the environment against these things. Crap. But I don't like the whole, you know, environment's out to get me kind of thing going on. Get over here. Get over here, wuss. There you go. Get over here. Get over. There you go. Oh. Got over here too far. <laughs> Back it up, right into the light. Back it up into the light. I'm not fighting that thing legitimately. What are you, high? That thing will murder me. Yes. Stupidity is a killer, kids. Don't let it be you. Don't let it be you. Oh, jeez. I mean, you can see my health just draining. That's what's the that same thing happening to him. There's only one left, thankfully. I, no, I think there's two. No, there's definitely two. Crap. 
Rack him up. Die. Come on. Over here, jackass. I don't want to die here. Oh, God. He's not going to come get me unless I move farther back. I don't want to do it this way, but I got to do it this way. Because... Oh. Jeez. You're a strong one. I guess the other one was just plain stupid. He didn't know he could just throw rocks. Crap, I guess I gotta do it. And by do it, I mean I ain't fighting it. <laughs> I ain't fighting these things. Ain't happening. Now, it should be said, you can get rid of that light. Uh, it's a bit, a fair bit farther, well, you know, in the level, but you can get rid of that light, so you don't have to just... Like, I would recommend just not dealing with all this crap first. Because, well, you don't need to. And this is a shortcut later in the level. It actually takes you right up to the... Margo's Wet Nurse, I think. Or takes you right near it, anyway. And it's been 20 minutes, right around the time I normally would do this anyway. So, we've gotten through the college, we've gotten to the second bonfire, the lantern. I keep saying bonfire. Which is pretty much pointless, I'll grant you. But it is, it is as far as I got. So, you know. I could go all the, through the entirety of the Nightmare of Mensis, but I hated that boss fight so much. Let me get my paper here. Not rolling paper, just, you know, paper. Because I don't smoke. Welcome. But, yeah. <laughs> I can't believe I drank two sedatives. I never use sedatives. But, uh, you know, in that kind of situation, it's either drink the sedative or you freaking die. I need 20 blood tinge. What the hell do I need 20 blood tinge for? Must be some kind of new ranged projectile weapon I need to the, for that to use. Okay, well, fair enough. What should I up next, though? Well, skill needs to be higher. I don't particularly know. Well, actually, what would be more used to me now? Vitality would be more used to me now, so I'll just do that now. Looks like if I'm going to be getting all the different stats I need, I'm going to have to, like, grind levels upon levels of co-op. But that would be good for me as well, because I need to get blood vials anyway, so I might just do that t this week. Or tomorrow, if someone had voted for the uh, Northern Cathedral District, I'll do that tonight, then. So, that's going to be it for today, guys. It's a decent amount of... Decent, far, decently, yeah, that was decently far. I am, I apologize for my poor use of the English language there. But hopefully I shall see you next time. Farewell until then.